Hello, my name is Andy and today I'm going to show you the data to memory feature of the Bode Analyzer Suite. To show you this feature, we have connected the Bode 100 to the quartz filter on our test board and we will measure the S parameter S21. Looking at the Bode Analyzer Suite, we see the red trace showing the S21 of the quartz. We are looking at the first serial and parallel frequency of the quartz. Now, when I touch the quartz filter, we can see that the parallel frequency jumps a little. Now, to, to see the difference between the previous measurement and the current measurement when touching the quartz, I will store the previous measurement when I release the quartz to, uh, to the memory by clicking data to memory. Now I will touch the quartz again and we see the jump. To display the memory, we can go to display and select memory. Now we have a dashed line showing the previous measurement. We can also show the difference between the two measurements by clicking data divided by memory. Here we can see the difference. When I release the quartz now, we can see that the difference will be minimized. Touching the quartz again shows the bigger difference. Further on, we can display data and memory. Here we can see the frequency shift between the original measurement without touching the quartz and the measurement by touching the quartz. This was the data to memory feature. Check out our other videos to see further functions of the Bode Analyzer Suite and applications with the Bode 100.